I want to take a couple minutes and celebrate my buddy Chuck. Uh, Chuck loved movies more than most people will ever love anything in their entire lives. My my most intense memories of Chuck are at a Chili's or an IHOP or at my apartment just hashing out Marvel movie by movie plot point by plot point. This guy could talk about movies six, seven, eight hours straight uh, without without skipping a beat. Um, and it was such a pleasure. It was such a pleasure, even though occasionally I was crawling on the floor exhausted by the time we were done with one of our session with one of our movie sessions. I, uh, I was, it was such a blast, man. Um, I met Chuck when I was a food runner at uh, Alamo Draft House, and he was a projectionist. Not just a project. He was like the he was the projectionist, right? Thirty five millimeter was still in the building, and uh, he was like a mythical creature to us then, um, or to people like me. Um, I mean, who, you know? It, I mean, as far as I was concerned, who goes and works in a movie theater and doesn't want to be a projectionist? Um, you know, that's that's why we're all there, right? And so, anytime he would pop up on the scene, it was like. Oh, there he is, you know, <laughs> and uh, eventually um, I had the pleasure of, uh, of becoming a projectionist myself and um, and got to call him a colleague uh, and then a friend. Um, right after I finished writing Luminous, uh, Chuck was the first collaborator I reached out to. Um, extremely talented artist, extremely talented musician. You know, I mean, my plan was to build a business uh, here locally where I could utilize um, his concept art talents, um, his sketch art talents on a regular basis. And, uh, and so I knew I was going to reach out to him from the get-go. And, um, and that's, I mean, and we did what we always did. We sat in, a, in an IHOP and we just talked about movies forever. And um, I was very fortunate that he got excited. The footprint he left with with the art that he did for the film, it it carries on through the last frame of the finish of the finished shot. And um, you know, I I was too slow. I was too slow in getting my business where I needed it to be, and uh, and our time was cut short. Um, but I am so grateful that he was a part of the project and I am so grateful that I had the opportunity to share the finished, um, the finished cut of the film with him, uh, before he passed. Chuck excited about something was awesome. <laughs> it was, it's hilarious because he was a goofball, but he, uh, um, when he got excited about something, uh, you know, his heart was huge, man. You could feel it. Um, you could feel it anywhere. So, um, Chuck, my friend, uh, thank you so much, uh, for being my friend and, um, um, fuck you 2020. Uh, I'll see you soon, buddy. Thank you. Thank you.